That is new music right there from Harry Styles on 102.7 KISS FM. And joining me now, the man himself, Harry Styles. Welcome. Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. Happy birthday. This is beyond a special treat for my birthday week. I, you're just, it, this is the cherry on top speaking to you, especially after this release, as it was, much. is incredible. Congratulations. Thank you so much. I'm, uh, I'm very glad you enjoyed it. Enjoy it. I want to yeah. dance to it. I want to work out to it. I want to sing it at the top of my lungs with the windows down. You can. You can do all of those things. How does it feel, Harry? I mean, this is your first new song since, what, 2019? Yes. Yeah. Um, it feels really nice. Um, I think, obviously, over the last three, two and a half, three years, uh, a lot has happened in the world and for everyone and, you know, me also personally. Um, I think this is kind of the best I've, I've felt about uh making music and putting music out so um it, it's been really exciting and and i've been trying to kind of you know be in each moment and uh i, I felt quite relaxed about everything that usually becomes very stressful with with this part of the process so i'm uh, i'm really happy yeah i'm excited that it's out that's interesting because, you know, coming off of your Love on Tour, which was incredible, by the way. I saw you at the Forum this past November. Thank you very much. Um, your energy on stage, Harry, is captivating. Like, it just, it's infectious. There's not, there was not one person sitting down at your concert. Um, where does Thank that come you. from? Um, I, mean, I mean, I'm not sure. I feel like, I feel like it's, uh, it's everything you know, that, that moment is kind of everything that you could ever imagine it would be as a child who loves music and someone who grew up, you know, watching people play music and listening to a lot of music. I think the moment when you're playing something and people are singing back something that you've written to you is kind of everything that you'd think it would be and so much more. Um, and, and also I think with the, with the tour that, the, um, we just did i think it was such a special moment of obviously everyone coming back together um you know the the first show of the tour was the first show that i'd been to since covid started wow. um which was pretty crazy and and i think obviously while we were touring around we were kind of we said before every show like you know it's important to remember that this is a lot of you know maybe we've played 30 shows already but this is the first show back from covid um for a lot of people so let's kind of give it like like every night is the first and last night of the tour so and you um, sure did it was amazing really I, I think you know the timing of it was i've never wanted to be on stage more i missed it so much and i think everyone in the audience was so ready to to um be in an audience and it felt like this kind of moment of coming back together it felt like a family of like strangers who were kind of bonded by this moment that everyone had been through so yeah um, it, it felt really special and and i won't forget it yeah i feel like we all have a new perspective when it comes to going out seeing shows appreciating yeah. our, our favorite artists things like that um i think you know it was you kind of notice what you turn to in in the moment we we're in and and every social interaction became so much more special i think you kind of you know, we, it's obviously really easy to take that kind of stuff for granted. And I think when we couldn't do it for such a long time, being back in a room together like that felt like a massive celebration every night. For sure. And simultaneously, I'm imagining you're working on this album, at Harry's House, which is out on yes. May 20th. Um, talk, yes. Walk me through this a little bit. I mean, obviously, the first single is out as it was yes what else can yes. we expect are there collaborations what, what can you tell us um there are no collaborations Ooh, okay um, i like it um apparently i'm apparently a very anti-social musician <laughs> harry doesn't want anybody um, at his house <laughs> but, but, yeah um no i think um i think for me like it's it's the most exciting um thing that i feel like i've made and 
um, I guess the most the most fun uh, music that I played everything together, and it was very much made in a in a kind of feeling of of a, a small house. So, um, you know, it, it's been the most enjoyable process so far that I've experienced in terms of making anything um, since I've been in music, and um, I think you know I, everything that I would ever hope to get out of the experience of making and putting out an album. I feel like I've I've been really lucky to experience already the kind of joy and and pride and happiness that comes out of that. So I feel like from you know I'm really really proud of what uh, we made together, and now everything feels like you know a bonus and a, a moment to celebrate and savor. So. Well, we are so excited, Harry, to to experience this album on May 20th. I'm excited to also see you at Coachella. I'll be out there weekend yes. one. Okay, so I'll look forward we, to seeing we got you. A, we got a few fun weeks lined up before that we album have. comes out. We have. It's a long, very long birthday. <laughs> yeah, um, his I'll birthday. It. Thank it you so lasts much until May 20th. Yes, it does. Well, thank you so much for taking the time, Harry Styles, everybody. Thanks oh, my so goodness. much for having me. As it was, is out now. 102.7 Kiss FM.